Yo, welcome back to my channel. And today I'm going to be doing a Schleich Barn Tour. My first Schleich Barn Tour, so it may not be the greatest. So let's just get started. This is our little welcome setup. This is Welcome to Horseland Farms with lots of decoration. Over here. <laughs> Sorry about the background noises. Um. And then we have horse pictures, and we do English Western Lessons, Boarding, Pony Club, and much more. And over here, it says Horse Stand Farms Office. The office door opens and closes. And that's what the inside looks like. There are some horse pictures and the desk that's... Pretty messy and a trash can and there's also a rug in there. This is S'mores or Campfire Light, the 2017 Pinto Mare. And over here we have Dottie, the 2014 Nap Stripper Full. And Sporty or Fine Sportsmanship, the 2007 Nab Stripper Mare. Over here, this is Andy, the 2010 Andalusian Full. And that's Memory or Memory Lane, one of my 2004 Tinker Mares. And it has this little covering over it. Over here we have the barn rules. No smoking, no screaming, no stealing, no pranks. Students must lounge in riders lounge. Our little cat tower. I'm not sure what it's actually called. That's tiger and over here is palm. We have a tree on either side of this paddock. This is Alice and she owns this horse, Sunshine or Sunshine Star. The 2014 track and her stallion. He has food and water and a little bareback thing. And over here, um, this is just a little bush over here because I don't have enough fencing to actually complete the paddock. And this is Harmony or Harmonious Melody, the 2012 Tennessee Walker Mare. Oh, and uh, whenever I say I need a show name... Uh, if you have any ideas in mind, I'd appreciate if you could comment them down below. And this is Shiloh, the 2016, I believe, Tennessee Walker Full. And this is Candy, the 2012 Tennessee Walker Yearling. This is Winnie, the 2014 paint mare. I know this is actually the 2014 track and her stallion, but I like to call her a paint mare. There's another horse like that. So, yeah, that's just what I did. I know they're actually not like that. This, whoops, this is Guinea, the... 2014 Paintful. And then, oh, and I forgot to say this is the Mare and Full Paddock. And this is Jenny. She doesn't have a show name, and she's the 2000 and, oops, 11 Pinto Mare. I am knocking everyone over. Well, you know what? I'll just leave it like that. The food spilled, but. And this is a um, patch, or patches and spots, the other 2004 Tinker Mare. And this is Gypsy, the 2005 Tinkerful. I, at first I thought she was the Gypsy Vannerful, and I didn't want to bother <laughs> to try and change the name. That is Cloudy or Above the Clouds, the 2005, I believe, um, Clydesdale Mare. This is Dream, the 2010 Clydesdale Full. 
Sparkle, the other, the other Shadesdale Fall from 2003, I believe. And this is Mercury. Hang on. I don't know what that's doing. Um, this is Mercury, the 2011 Pinto Yearling. And when I waved my hand in front of there, as I thought something on the camera was telling me to do that, but I guess not. <laughs> this is the Mare Turnout Paddock. Um, yeah, no one's in it right now. And a lunch line and lasso, that's what's up here. And here, this is Coco or Coco Bean, the 2002 Arabian there. Pepper or Salt and Pepper, the 2015 Nabstrapper Mare. This is Ginger, and she doesn't have a show name. And she's the 2005 Hanoverian Mare. And this is Honeycomb. I don't know her year, but she's the Percheron mare. And I'm not sure if I said that right. There are grooming boxes in there. Uh, or brushes in the grooming boxes. I just don't have anywhere there to put them right now. And there's a hayloft. I don't know why I do my barn tours this way. But then I'm going to come over here. And this is Clover or Cloverfield, the 2016 Arabian Stallion. This is Tornado or the Forces of Nature, the 2010 Clydesdale Gelding. This is Pluto, and he doesn't have a show name. He's one of the 2000 and, oops, 2007... Pinto stallions. And here, I should have brought a flashlight. <laughs> this is Eclipse or Solar Eclipse. 2007 Arabian stallion. Back here is Falcon or Taking Flight. The 2007, I believe, Pertron stallion. And this, I believe I changed his name to San Antonio. And he doesn't have a show name right now. Uh, he's the... I don't know the year, but he's the Andalusian Stallion. This is Star or Proud Star, the Tennessee Walker Mare. And this is Jupiter, and he doesn't have a show name. And he's the other 2007 Pinto Stallion. Here is our storage room. Some barrels and a veterinary kit there. That's just some random stuff. Jess's grooming box, a random grooming box, and Michelle's grooming box. And then so there's some more random stuff in here. And then this ladder goes up to our feed room, which I won't go into detail on, but it looks like that. And then this is our tack room. The door does open and close, but the stuff falls down very easily, so I don't really want to open it. And that is Alice's tack, a wall of halters and lead ropes. And that is Jackie's tack, and you will meet her in a minute. And then outside, this is to tie your horses. And around here, we have some rags for washing horses and some sponges. So this is like a little wash station. Um, to make room for the new tack room, I believe I got rid of my old wash stall. And this is Domino, and he doesn't have a show name. And he is the 2008 Tinker Stallion. Oops, I wasn't showing you him, sorry. Here is Jackie and her pony Hearts, or Candy Hearts, who is the 2014, I believe, uh, mini Shetty Mare. And this is Dakota, or Dakota Dreams, the 2014 Arabian Mare. And that is Bay, the 2000, and I don't know what year he's from. But he's the Arabian Fool. And over here, in this little alleyway, kinda, 
This is Goldie, a little golden retriever puppy, and he is just adorable. He is going to play with the bunnies over here. Uh, this one is Oreo, this one is Snowy, and that one down there is Cutie. And then we have some Paws here and some Cavaletti X's down there. This is Jessica turning out her horse Honey or Sweetest Honey, the 2014 Haftinger mare. And over here, this is Cobalt or Indigo Storm, the 2013 Thoroughbred Stallion. She like calls him uh, Appaloosa Stallion, but that's just because he's the same mold as the Appaloosa Stallion. I changed him to a thoroughbred. This is Amelia talking to Michelle, probably about responsibility because she makes uh, Abby do all of her work. And that's just the front of the stable. This is a shared turnout paddock. I'm kind of rushing because I think I'm on a time limit here. Can't go more than 16 minutes now. That's what it looks like when you enter the barn. Um, whoops. You see that bulldog right there? That's in the arena. He's not supposed to be there. <laughs> okay. Um. <laughs> Hang on. I want to take the roof off my barn so I can take you guys inside. There we go. As you can see, I took the roof off. This is Honey's stall. And that is Jessica's tack. This is Cobalt's stall, and that is Eva, who's mucking out his stall. And this is Abby, who's talking to her, I believe, about a lesson schedule. And this is Eva's tack. This is Silk, or Pure Silk, the 2013 Lipa's Honor Mayor. And that is Michelle's tack. It's trick riding tack. And the uh, little bucket. Silk's little bucket with her halter and lead rope, or head stall, whatever you want to call it. And her pull wraps. This is Jess's tack. We'll meet her in a minute. Uh-oh. Okay, thank you. And this is uh, Stella, and she needs a show name. And she's the other 2014 Arabian mare. And that is Prancer, the 2014 Arabian foal. And... Yeah, uh, she has a bucket too, but it's kind of hard to see with her halter and knee rope or head stall in it and her pull wraps. Hang on, now I need to put the, ta uh, the top back on the barn. And this just has some uh, harness supplies. Like, I can't, I can't even get it open, but yeah, it's in there. Our picnic stuff for picnic rides. This is the student lounge, and this is Jess. She owns Stella, and Stella and Silk share this turnout paddock. She's just in the student lounge right now. Lounging. That's our arena that has grown a lot since, well, I first had an arena. There's some jump storage all around that area. And then, last but not least, well, maybe least, this is our little pony club building where we hold our pony club meetings. Yeah, nothing special about that. I'm going to give you guys an overview. So, thank you for watching. Um, whoops. And as I said, I will be doing in my intro video and bridal tutorial, I will be doing more detailed like barn tours in the future and probably less less rushed ones and i will see you all in my next video bye